Capricorn weekly messages for the 19th through the 26th of August, 2023. Check back weekly for more readings like this one and know that I'll never ever solicit you. We are moving into Virgo season from Leo season. And that's all about kind of getting organized, getting the details, getting on top of things and putting thought to action. What type of energy is around you that can help you? What type of energy that might hinder you? And some daily advice for healing. Let's get into this for you. So what do we have? So we've got energy protection for you, Capricorn. So I feel like this is you like needing to learn how to like better protect your energy. So I feel like you might believe that you're unsafe and it could be creating more of a feeling of that and might make you be attracting more people that are kind of like throwing your energy off or throwing your energy out of balance or, you know, making you feel crazy or not in control of your energy or yourself. And, um, you know, you might be spreading yourself too thin. So I feel like you have to know that you are safe and you are fully protected from the light of God and the light of the universe. And you have to start to affirm this. And I feel like you might be feeling really overwhelmed. To me, this is like screaming spiritual awakening, um, finding out, gee, I'm an empath for the, you know, this, this is to me like a lot of energy all at once overwhelming you. This is to me like a change in consciousness about it and an awakening and, a, and a, a being, becoming aware that you are this way. You are more sensitive to energies around you. You may work a job that, you know, is very draining. If you work in healthcare, it's very, very, very rewarding, but it could be very, very draining, especially if you're not protecting your energy. You could benefit Capricorn from like an evil eye or a pennant of some kind or a selenite wand or crystals that can help you. I feel like learning grounding, shielding, protecting, and clearing your energy daily will help you greatly. You could be even getting sensitive to crowds. You could be even becoming almost a little bit of a, like a recluse where, you know, you go out and your energy gets spent up and then, you know, maybe you want to hide behind closed doors for a few days. I feel like there's a lot of people too that suck from you. There's a lot of people who need from you. There's a lot of people who lower your vibration because they're in a lower vibration you just have to try to find what your center is, Capricorn. Your center is a place of peace, a place of safety, security within yourself. Try not to be around low energy people. Try not to talk to them. Try to, you know, turn your body away from these people when you're speaking to them. Because direct contact, like belly button to belly button, they're going to suck you. Try to keep your thoughts positive. Try to... Visualize yourself in white light and around you and around your space and start at your head and let it kind of flow all throughout your aura and let it kind of like be like a shower of light all around you. Like so it could kind of like suck you up into that light and protect you like you've got shields around you, like you've got an electric fence around you. Try not to fear or give into fear thoughts. That does not help. It attracts more negative energy and entities to you. And it gets harder to combat. But when you imagine the white light or the whatever color you could do, golden light. When you imagine that this light is protecting you and shielding you from harsher energies, it can really help. I also feel like once you align with the truth and believe it, you will begin to see results immediately. Remember that whatever you give, your energy will grow. And you have to kind of shift your focus from fear to love. Try not to give into fear-based thinking or give into any lower thoughts or lower emotions. You have to try to shift your focus from fear to love. And know that you're protected. You truly are. What is one one message for you, Capricorn? Do something to improve yourself. Any improvement you make 
will benefit all of humanity. Wow, that's very deep. Check back next week, Capricorn, for more messages. Love and light.